Hey boardies, welcome to Mass Games. My name is Simon and today I'm bringing you a review of the game, well of course, it's Legend of the Five Rings. This time it's a novel though of Death's Kiss, a Daojin mystery by Josh Reynolds. Now I have already reviewed his prior book, you know, maybe you know what I thought of this one. This one I give a pretty much an excellent rating. Great story, uh, very involving, lots of action, very enjoyable. And yeah, not a single typo, not a single mistake, no grammatical errors, um, flawless in that respect. Very much enjoyable story, building upon the last book as well, not that you have to read it. It does kind of do recaps and stuff. So if you don't want to read the other one, you don't have to. You just want to jump straight in to the most recent um, release. And this is by Anakite Games. This is um, obviously various novels which are obviously in the universe of board games. I highly recommend this one. Of course, please check out the playlist for various other... Uh, board game novels of course there are many more coming as well so of course please do subscribe hit the notification bell and hit that like button and share and let you know me in the comments let me know what your thoughts are on this and finally if you and you might have noticed um certainly worth slightly i have recently come back from the americas where i have been reading this book as well lastly if you head over to the description you can find out how to support the channel via patreon and see the 2200 photos over on instagram Aside from that, um, I was going to read, which I did take with me as well, to read The Harrowing of Doom, which is another Marvel book. I always thought it was called The Harrowing Doom. And the interesting thing about this one is, of course, I've played a lot of Marvel games so much, in fact, that I've actually now got a playlist as well for all my Marvel-related board games. But two new games, uh, well, books have arrived as well. Pandemic, so massive fan of the Pandemic system. I'll be playing Lich King after this. And very look forward to reading this by Amanda Bridgman. And this is Patient Zero. In fact, this is the very first one I got from Anakite as an ebook. But I thought I'd wait until obviously I can get the um, the paperback, which of course there has been some delays with uh, the pandemic shortage. So aside from that, I'm also very keen to read Terraforming Mars, which I'm also very keen to play solo as well, particularly Ares Expedition. So I'm going to do these back-to-back -back two solo plays. This time it's called In the Shadow of Diamos by Jane Killick. So I look very much forward to reading this one as well. Now, as I mentioned, Josh has made uh, the prior book to this as well. And if you are interested, the Descent uh, series of games and books, the books in particular, there are two books again by um, that particular uh, author. So I look forward to reading that one by Robbie. And also there are two books in another series also on this channel, and that's in the Twilight Imperium universe. I'm very looking forward to reading the follow-up book, which I very much enjoyed, very much a Guardians of the Galaxy feel. And that's going to be the, the Necropolis Empire by Tim Pratt. So looking forward to reading this. Again, uh, Robbie McGiven, look forward to checking out this Descent book as well. Again, like I said, this one's coming too. So the next two I'm really keen to check out. There are other books in the Legend of the Five Rings. Uh, typically a game I'm not a big fan of compared to other board games which have been turned into novels. But so far, I've, like I said, been very interested. So this has been Legend of the Five Rings. Hopefully you found this of interest. Please, of course, let me know, as I said. And I look forward to bringing you the next one, which will be Patient Zero, which is 380 pages. So it's not as light as the other ones. Speak to you soon.